Shirley and Marion. And um, the one my husband is the friends used to say, Rod is Anna Shirley, your mother's name is George. <laughs> but he, he really was an Shirley. He was a wonderful, wonderful, extraordinary writer and uh, worked for the Washington Post until the age of something like 93. Uh, and uh, so Maury, his brother David, and his sister Lynn decided to create a chair in their father's name. So it's a chair of sports journalism in the department of, uh, journal department here in Maryland. And Brody came up to our apartment and met with us and told us all about Maryland. I suddenly discovered after graduating from here in 1969 that Maryland had been transformed thanks to some amazing people like President Dan Moat, who was your president here at the university for quite a while, <clears throat> and created a new university, truly. It became, it is now competitive with Berkeley and Michigan. You should be so proud to be going here. It is a, a high academic achievement. The, uh, you had to have such a high grade point average to get in and everybody's graduating with great, uh, great point averages. You, uh, you have Nobel Prize winning professors. You have top ranked um, uh, professors and schools. It's just extraordinary. It's a major complex that has tapped the resources of Washington, D.C. Uh, with research facilities. It's just amazing. It's an international school. So um, I had no idea, uh, because when I went here, it was just, you know, just the state school. And I used to actually, honestly, be a little embarrassed. I used to work on, when I was covering Capitol Hill for CBS, um, 